Good morning. It is Friday. I believe it's the 29th. And I've been on my walk. Taking it kind of slow today. I've been walking for about 10 minutes. And I'm almost over here to the freight train yard. I decided to come in a different route today. And I've kind of not been doing this. This route because it seems to be kind of a tent city down here at times. But I looked down the road here, which I'm almost to the end of, and I really didn't see any tent cities. So I don't see anybody around. Doesn't mean that they're not, but they're not right here. So we'll kind of enter from this direction and see what's going on. As you can see, it's, it gets trashed pretty good down here. Looks like somebody is building, cleaning the place up. Oh, I see his tent. Yep. Have to get over here a little farther. Oh. There's a tent there and there's a guy there. Yeah. Well, we're not going to hang around here. Actually, had something else I wanted to go show you guys on my walk, so I need to go in the other direction. So, we'll do that. We got somebody over there. Alright, well, we'll go back this direction and then we'll go even farther to the south. And we'll have a look at that house that caught fire. It was in the springtime, I believe. Early summer. When that house caught fire. And it was actually set on fire by a woman. By a homeless woman. And she is hopefully still in jail. Uh, but I don't know. Anyway, we'll go have a look at that. <sighs> And then some pretty good exercise this morning. Some walking. So, insomnia update real quick. I did not have insomnia yesterday. Last night. And as the day went on yesterday, I just stayed home the rest of the day. I didn't go for a morning walk. Or an evening walk like I mentioned that I probably would. I didn't do that. Because it got over 100 degrees at that time. And it's going to be the same thing today. It's going to be triple digits for sure. So, anyway, I, uh, by the time dinner came around, I was pretty worn out. I was just dead tired on my feet. And so I laid down. And I don't really remember much after that. I went to sleep pretty quick. So apparently my insomnia is over for the time being. Oh, I'm getting winded. And uh, hopefully it won't be back. Anyway, let's head down here and have a look at the destroyed house. So I say destroyed house because in probably the first video I'm looking at it, I mentioned that I didn't think it would be savable. Uh, I'm no expert, of course, but it's pretty easy to tell when a house is burned too much that it can't be saved, especially an older house. And that's exactly what has happened to this old place. It stood right there. I'm not sure when this was bulldozed tore down but I didn't think it'd be able to be saved I really don't use this street much sometimes I walk on it but I really don't drive up and down this street so as you can see it's gone it's been removed so I'm sure something else will be erected here pretty soon all right so that's gonna be it I'm gonna head back home and take it easy today. Got a bunch of 
videos to start editing on and things like that. So I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.